I'm Mr. Hatfield. This is second grade at Maplewood Elementary, and we are here learning today what is force, motion, and position with Mr. Croslin. Hey, thanks for that introduction. You know, I'm here at Maplewood, and we're studying in second grade some pretty cool concepts. We're studying about force, motion, and position. So here's how this lesson is gonna go. We're gonna do some demonstrations. We're gonna make some drawings. We're gonna use some tools and instruments. We're gonna test some ideas, and then we're gonna read about it and see if that's true. Are you guys up for it? Yeah! Okay, so here's the first thing. Force, let's take a look at force. And if I write it, you should write it. Force, a force is when a force is when an object is moved. A force is when an object is moved. I like your handwriting. Thank you. If I write it, you write it. So a force is when an object, it takes a force to move an object. You believe that? Well, we're going to try it. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. May the force be with you. May the force be with you. Where's that from? Star Wars. No, it's from science, man. May the force be with you. I'm wearing a Star Wars shirt. <laughs> All right, I'm going to need you just a second up here. Okay, so force. A force is when an object's moved. We all have the force with us, like Star Wars. There's two types of forces we're going to talk about today. Are you ready for this? Yes. Yeah. All right, I'm going to put an arrow. I'm going to go this way, and an arrow is going to go this way. One type of force is called a push, a push force. What do you think the other is called? Pull. Who said that? You're my favorite student right now. Pull. So the other type of force is a pull force. Go ahead and write this like I'm writing it. Let's take a closer look. So you got your Star Wars shirt on and since we're talking about the force, that's a good thing. And so, is the force strong with this one, young Obi-Wan? Yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Put your hands up against me. Put both hands, okay, both hands. Go ahead and push. You show me a push force, push, come on, push, push. That's all he's got. That's it. Darth Vader, you're kind of weak, man. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh. He's, he's using a force now. Who's using a force? I have, I have a lightsaber at my house. Uh, push, push. Don't Show make me. me use it. Okay. Okay, there's a push force. Oh, I'm going to push back. Oh, oh God. Too much force. Are right, you okay, Darth? Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Has lots of okay, so that was a push. Are you okay? Yeah. Take your hands and push against me. Push, easy, push, push. Now, let's show a pull force. Show me a pull force. I don't know how to do this. Okay, you do, ready? Pull. <laughs> <laughs> show me a pull force. Yo, he's a quick learner. He's okay. stronger than you. Right, ready? Here comes a pull. Show him a pull. Now, show me a push. Okay, and push. All right, let's everybody do this together. Darth, stand next to me. Okay. Wall. Wall, everybody. Push. Pull. Ready? Push. Pull. One more time. Everybody say it. Push. Pull. Everybody say, may the force be with you. May the force be with you. <laughs> Thank you. So, um, force is a push or a pull. Let's take a look at something else. So I have this game I like to play, which is I use a rope and a force. And and, and oh, would you come over here? Um, and you uh, see so you being right there. Let's get. Uh, would you have three students come up and stand to hold it right about there? Okay. Um, Tristan, Fernando, and Ariana. Okay. And so, get a little bit closer, get closer, you guys get closer, no, you stay there, and you guys get closer. Okay, you guys come closer. Okay, there you go, take up the slack. Now, I like to call this game, no, this game is called Pull-A-War, it's a force game. Now, you guys take up the slack, 
Pull, pull, pull more. There you go. Pull. Keep pulling. Take up the slack. Okay. Uh, now nobody gets hurt, especially the teacher. <laughs> and let's see this. This is a force demonstration. Show me a pull award. Go ahead. Pull. 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 Don't go there. Okay. Wow, the force is strong with those. And I'm, you're losing your grip. All right, relax, relax. Um, draw a picture in your journal, call it pull a war. Pull a war. So we just saw a pull a war, not a push a war. But we used a lot of force, and I'm glad no one got hurt. That was good. Now we're going to move a little bit to after force, we're going to talk about motion. And motion is when something's moving. Check this out. Ready? Tell me what kind of motion this is. Ready? Run. Run. Back and forth. Fast. Was that fast motion? Yeah. Oh, ready? Watch. Fast motion? Uh, yeah. Watch this motion. Slow motion. Slow motion. Slow motion. Slow motion. <laughs> Come demonstrate that with me. Come here. Come on, man. I'll right. do it. Show me fast motion. Go. Okay. <laughs> Give me your pencil so you don't get hurt. Show me fast motion. Go. Okay, now show me slow motion. Here he comes. Slow motion. There you go. Give me five on that one. Hey, you missed me, man. <laughs> Let's look at the motion of this ball. Are you ready? Yeah. You catch it, okay? Are you good at catching? Easy. Look at the motion of this ball. Ready? Throw it. Now throw it to That's me. That's a heavy ball. And to me. It is heavy. Okay. Let's use your eyes to observe. Easy. Okay, here's what I want to do. Hold up for a second. I'm going to draw with that motion. You draw it also. Hold that, please. So here's A. Did it look like from here to here? Is that what? Did it look like that? No. Throw, throw, throw it back to me. Watch. Did it go like that? Yeah. Is that that? No. Oh. oh, did it go like this? Wait a minute. Did it go back and forth? No. no. That was not? Yes. Okay, wait about this. No. Try C. How about this? I bet it went like this. Did it go like this? <laughs> zigzag, zigzag, no. zigzag. No. no. It didn't go like that? Show throw them again. Throw them. Oh, easy. It didn't go like that? No. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Did it go like this? D. Uh, ready? Did it go like this? No. no. Okay. Um, wait a minute. I don't know. No. I think it went. Um, these are all different types of motion. I bet it went like this. Ready? No. No. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Did it go like this? No! Would, 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 oh, yeah, that kind throw of it one more time. Throw it one more time. And can someone come up and draw how it did go? Would you come and show me how it did? Because I don't, I don't, I'm not getting it. You guys draw all these motions? Show me. Start, let's, go, let's call it G. G and circle it. Yeah. How'd it go? Started there. Oh, look what she did. Look, look, look. Thank you. Look, she started here and it went up. Do you catch it? Let's see. You, you catch it. Really? Easy. Oh, I see. Look. Do it again. Up again. It goes like this. Go ahead. Again. One more time. Okay, let's see. Can you guys do this one? Let's see if they can do this motion. Easy. Oh, look, look. They're doing it. Do it again. Yeah, but they... oh. <laughs> really? Really? We got that on tape. Easy. Oh. That one's harder. This is All right. Nice. Now, can you do this one? Oh, that's going to be hard. You got to bounce it. You got to bounce it. Bounce it. There's a zigzag. Can you do it? Bounce it. Zig, zag. Again. Hard, zig, zigzag, zigzag. <laughs> um, can, could you do this one? That's gonna be hard. Yeah, I mean, we'd yeah, have to do it like this. You'd have to go like this. I don't think we can do that one. I don't know. No. Uh, oh, can we, can can we do this one? That's easy. Really? What do you no, mean? Do that? Oh, what about F? Can we do this one? Can we make something turn in mid? Yeah. 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 Watch. Yeah. Ready? You guys that. just make it go nice and easy, back and forth. Go ahead. No. 
Are you watching? We're gonna see if we can make it do this. Go ahead, go. Go ahead. Easy to her. Up. How did it go that way? Go here. There was another force. Look, we can make it. Oh god. We can make it do this. No, you can move it. When it goes like this, what did I do? I put another force, didn't I? Watch what happens. Do it again. <laughs> ready? You're going to throw it easy. You're going to catch it. But I'm going to make another force go that way. So be ready. Here he goes. Oh, God. Easy. Easy. <laughs> right on, Did you see how the force changed? See how the force? You throw it this time. And let's see if I can make the force. Here we go. Ready? Okay. Let me take a look at your workbook pages, what you've drawn. Before we leave force and motion, I have a broken bowling ball. And this has no energy, but now I'm going to push it up, push it up. And when I let go, what do you think it's going to do? Drop. It's going to drop. What's going to, who can describe how it's going to drop? Yes. Gravity. Gravity. And what kind of force is gravity? Is it a push or a pull? A pull. pull. So I push it up. Everybody say, I'll count to three and everybody say, gravity pulls. Gravity pulls. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Gravity pulls. It pulled it down. Let's try that again. I'm going to, uh, ready? I'm going to push it up. One, two, three. Gravity pulls. Gravity pulls. Let's try it, everybody. Hold your ball on your desk. Oh, keep it on your desk. Put it on your desk. Lift it up. Push it up. One, two, three. Gravity pulls. Let's try it one more time. On your desk. Push it up. One, two, three. Gravity pulls. One more time. Push it up. One, two, three. Three. Gravity pulls. All right. Go ahead and draw a picture of that. Draw a picture of that. I like how you're putting the words gravity pulls. Nice job. Okay, we've studied a little bit about force. We've studied about motion. Now we're going to talk about position. Position is where an object is. Is a word an object is staying in place. In place. It is in place. That's its position. Its position. Now, I want to do a little experiment, okay? Everybody take a look at me. Shut one eye and look where my head is. Ready? See my head's right here? What's behind my head? That right there, okay? Shut your now shut both your eyes. Shut your eyes. Now open your eyes. Did I change position? Yes. How do you know? Because we were right behind the position. Oh, oh look. Okay, shut one eye. Look at my head. What's behind me? That's a nail. Now shut both eyes. Shut both eyes. Open your eyes. Did I change position? Yes. How do you know? Because I was right behind the position. All right. Would you, would you come here? Yes. All right, watch this. What's your name? Ashley. Show what I look at Ashley. Shut both eyes. Ashley's position changed. Yes. Where is where was Ashley? Now where is she? She's right there. She's right. So here's a word to write. She was right, and then she was left. left. Huh, Ashley, you get all over the place. Let's try it again. Ready? Right to the left. Look, shut one eye. Did her position change? Yes. Where is she now? I 
<laughs> okay, what words? She is in front, right? Yeah, in front of me. Write that word. Let's try it again. Shut one eye, look at Ashley. The position change? Where's she at? Behind, so write the word behind. All right, ready, B E H I N D. Let's try it a couple of times, ready? What? Excuse me, shut one eye. Shut both eyes. Did the position change? Now she's above me. So write the word above. How'd you do that? Above. These are words that we use to describe position. Let's do one more. Ready? Shut one eye. Shut both eyes. Where is she now? She's below. Go ahead and write that word. Ashley, you get all over the place. One more thing for Ashley to do. Okay, ready? This is a good one. Shut one eye. Look at her. Shut both eyes. Okay, open your eyes. Where, she's not in here. Where is she? Behind. What word should we use? Outside. Outside. Outside, outside right? She is outside. And Ashley, come on back. When she comes back, what is she going to be? Inside. Inside. So let's review. Thank you, Ashley. Give her a round of applause, everybody. Nice job, Ashley. Ashley, use some force to change your position by motioning over there. Get over there. <laughs> so we talked about force, motion, and position. I tell you what, let's take a closer look at some experiments I want you to do. Okay, hey guys. So just to review, we talked about a push. Here's a push and a pull. Okay, a push and a pull. Those are the two forces we talked about. And I was looking up on the board. Remember we had that one to go back and forth. Here's one way to do it. These are things I want you to do in just a moment. Like there's motion, straight, that was like A up on the board. Remember that A, back and forth? And then this one is B. And then this one, this is a hard one. Let's see if you can do it, ready? Zigzag, zig, zag, zig, zag. You see that one? Yeah. And then this one is kind of hard to do. Let's see if I can do it. This is a swirl, you ready? I'll put a dot on this so you can see it better maybe. Ready? Here we go. It's like Can you see the motion? Can you see the motion of that? Wow, that went like, that went, hey, where are you going? Hey, come here. <laughs> so we had some motion that went like this. The motion kind of went zigzag and zigzag, and I kind of like that one. Um, let's try it again. Ready? Huh. Crazy. There it goes. Now, one of them that might be hard to do. We did this one when, when the ball was going to go straight, right? But watch what happened when I had another force. So if I, get ready. When I push it this way, it goes right to you, right? Put it back to me. There's a push and a push. I can go slow. And we can go faster. Ready? <laughs> Crazy. Now, here's one that's kind of interesting. Watch this. I'm going to make slow to you, but watch what happens when the new force comes in. Ready? Here it comes. Slow to you. How come it didn't go to him? Because it had two forces. Here's a push. Here's one push, but here's another push. Bring it back. Easy. Not so much force. The force is strong with that one, young Obi-Wan. So here's a slow force. Ready? Here comes another force. Okay. But here's the one that you... How can we make this go in a circle, I wonder? Oh, you're smart. Okay, ready? Watch. See how it's going in a circle? Now here's a hard question for you. If I let go of this... Is it going to keep going in a circle? No. Is it going to zigzag? No, no, it is. It's, going to shoot forward. it's going to shoot forward, you think? It's going to go slower. Okay, on the count of three, you say lift, and I'll lift it. How many people think it's going to stay in a circle? How many people think it's going to go zigzag, zigzag? How many people think like this guy, it's going to go forward? All right, let's find out. You say one, two, three, lift. One, two, three, lift. Whoa, we what did right. he do? He was right, wasn't he? We were right. It went straight. Let's try it again. Whoever said that. Give me, ready? One, two, three, lift. 
<laughs> That's pretty amazing. It goes, it goes the way it's closest to. It goes the way it's closest to. See. That's how things move in a straight line unless a force acts on them. Here we go. Ready? Tell me. Why everybody say one, two, three, lift. One, two, three, lift. Nice. Okay. You notice that I that I didn't slam them. I didn't. They didn't fall off the table. Watch this. I don't know if you can try this. I'm gonna use a block. What? what Looks like a ramp. It is a ramp. But how? I'm gonna see if I can make the ball go. Let's see if it works. Ready? See that? Mm -hmm. You see how it went? It went kind of, it went backwards. It kind of went up. That's G. That is G. Very good up on the board. Let's make a smaller ramp. Ready? Nope. Kind of. That's F, kind of. Yeah. So, so I want you to try those when we get back. But now, I got my friend here. Let's put this over. Let's put this down here. What's your name? David. Xavier. Xavier. This is a science tool, Xavier. This is a science tool. Yeah, some people call it a science instrument. And look, when you get these, we want to uh, use them but not break them. Whoa. Whoa. This is 100 centimeters. It goes to 99. Everybody say 100 centimeters. 100 centimeters. If I turn it over, though, it is inches. And it only goes up to about 30. Five, six, seven inches. I want to ask use this question. You, what's your question? Can you can you measure an anaconda with this? You can measure an anaconda with it, but you're going to have to use a lot of them because I've seen anacondas and they are sometimes twelve of these long. Oh. Oh. Okay, are you ready? Tell me your name again. Well, change of plans. Xavier. No anaconda. Let's see, oh. Xavier. Let's start on this centimeter row. Let's turn around. Ready? Oh wow. Xavier, let's see if we can. If you can use your straw and a force to make this go, let's give, give me that yellow ball instead. See the yellow ball right there? Let's try that yellow ball. Xavier, can you make this go 25 centimeters? <laughs> that boy's got some force. I have that force. But that was, uh, you probably do, but that was 100. Uh, can you make it only go 25 centimeters? What was he going to have to do? Blow it gently. You use less what? Force. force. That's no oh, that's meters. pretty good. It went, yeah, it went now, about 44 centimeters. Yeah, back up a little bit. Let's see. Now, can you make it go 75 <laughs> centimeters? You put your finger by 75. That's going to be easy. Oh, I can see it. Oh, okay. oh, 75 is in the middle. Uh, uh, oh, right. almost made it. Let's try it on one breath. One breath, 75. Let's try it on the set. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh nice so one. close. Now, let's see. Can you make it go 100 centimeters? That's easy. That's easy. Brandon. Okay. All right, so let me ask you this. Watch this, okay? Check it out. What happens if, if he blows that way, and if I blow this way, which way, if, if I blow, which way is it going to go? You guys, okay. guys got to blow at different times. If he starts here, his his force went that way. Xavier went that way. I'm going to blow. Hey, that kind of looks like the one that you made on the board that we're going to pass. I know. So I'm going to blow. See if I can make it back up. Uh, you can actually catch this up. Ready? Here comes my force. <laughs> uh. Oh, look, it went my way. All right, Xavier, give it some force and make it go your way. Get closer to it. Okay. Guys, now, here's my hey, question for you. My question for you, if we both blow at the same time, get ready, get It'll closer. Get closer. Go that way. Wait a minute. Okay, if we blow the same force, it's it might go A. Middle. You says it might go here? B. B, really? You think it's going to go like this? Ding, 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 yeah. And or it could be C. Which do you guys think it will go? B. Really? You think so? Let's, let's find out. Ready? I'm blowing this way. I'm blowing this way. He's blowing that way. On the count of three, blow. One, two, three, blow. Told you. I knew. No way. Well, I, 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 I think if you try it like this and blow like that, let's see. Ready? Here we go. Let's try it again. One. You and you guys count for us. One, two, three. Told you. Oh, did you see that? Yes. So my force 
My force wanted to go that way. His force wanted to go that way. The ball went both ways. Let's try it one more time. Now, see, I'm blowing this way. He's blowing that way. But with two forces, they compromise. One, count for me. Oh, wow. it kind of went. Nice. Okay. Uh, would you put this back? Let's try something different. Okay, so this is an instrument or a tool. It has centimeters and inches. You're going to use that. This is another instrument. Check it out. Yeah, I love that one. Now, this is called a spring scale, and it can be used to find the weight of something or the force of something. So watch this. Back up just a little bit. Now, what I don't want people to do is this. You guys all back up just a little bit. Don't do this. Don't go like this, thing, because it'll break it. That's not what it's made for. See, there's numbers here on the side and numbers here. Some are in grams and some are in, in newtons or ounces. Okay? Oh. What happens if I do this? Watch. So I have a bag. You guys all have a plastic bag. Oh, no. And this bag has a hole in it so I can hook something onto it. Ready? Watch this. Oh. Hook that on there. Okay. Now I'm going to pull this bag on the ground and we're going to see. Look at the numbers here. Is that zero? Is that zero? Will it stay the same when I pull or will it change? Stay. Let's find out. Ready? Watch, watch. Did it change a little? Hmm, not too bad. A little bit. What if, I, what if I add one block? It will change. Yes. Is it, it going to go more force or less? More. more. Right, watch. It's at zero. Watch. Here we go. Ready? Oh, oh it yeah, it did go. It's in between zero and 50, about 25. What's going to happen if I add two blocks? It's going to go to 50. It's going to get 50. Okay, let's see. It's going to go higher. Let's see. Was it zero? 25. Let's yeah. see. I Tell think me. It's going to go right there. Where? It might go between. <laughs> Let's find out. Ready? One, two, three, force. Uh, oh, right at, at 50. Guess. Right at 50. That was my first guess. What if we add... Oh, it's going to go... What do you think now? Oh, a hundred. A hundred. About a, about Let's see. Who predict? 100? Anybody think 100? 150? Yeah. 200? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Ready? 200. Three, two, one, force. Uh, like 125. Yeah, boy. Oh, let's add a few more things. Whoa. Your phone in there. Now you notice I'm not slamming it or trying to break it. Okay, so we added more things. That is better. Added more things. Let's see. Here we go. Let's try the force. You think 250, 200? May the force be with you, little stick. Oh, my God. No, may the force be with you, little spring scale. Whatever. That's called a spring scale. I right. Let's find out. Here we go. Ready? It won't. I don't know. Zero. 50. 75. 100. 125, 150, 175, 200. Do it. Boom. 200. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, 250. Okay, now I want to show you something. Watch this. What if we do this? This is a cart. No wheels. Wheels, that's a simple machine. I'm going to put everything on here. Whoa. It was at 200, right? No. Now I'm going to use the wheels. What do you it's think it's going to be? It's best it's going to be 20. 20. You think the wheels are going to make it easier? Yeah. yeah. Let's find out. There's zero. Here we go. Ready? Probably going to be like. Yep. Oh, you 100. see that? 100. Did it go to 100? Let's do it again. What? Look carefully. No, it didn't go to 100. I don't think. Look there. It went, it went to 50. 50. About 100. Isn't that amazing that it went to 50? We it's, didn't change. It's an airplane. It, yeah, it looks like an airplane, but look, the wheels yeah. caused it to do that. All right, so here's what I'd like you to do. Go back to your seats. I'm going to give you about a few minutes to explore before we start these. That's good. See if you can use the straw to make a force to move the ball.
I don't have a snowball in my hand. Or a star. <laughs> yours is hard because yours is a tennis ball. You have to use a lot of force on that one. There you go. <laughs> Very nice. Find out. So you can see the marks. Turn this over so you can see the marks. Now pull it. What'd you say? Yours went to what? 125. Go ahead and show me. We've ended our hands-on and now we're going to look at our science book to apply what we've learned.